Okay, so we're going to work on a vault toss. And what we're going to do is we're going to hold it flat and reach down slightly below our waist and kind of roll it in. Yep. And we're going to reach up and we're going to set it up on the shelf as we open, yep, as we open our hand. And we'll rewind it, reach down, set it on the shelf. Good. And what we're looking for here, Sue, is for the disc to rotate all the way up. And then we just let go at the top and set it on the shelf. Ready? Okay. So we're going to down here. We're going to throw up and set it on the shelf. Good. Beautiful. Reach straight up. Set it on the shelf and let it go. Nice. There we go. Good job. Set it on the shelf. Good. And let's get back to that set. So don't throw it. Boom. Right there. Good. And a couple more times. Check it like that. Boom. And now get it moving and set it on that shelf. Great job. Okay, that's going up and coming straight down on us. Um, we want to be able to throw this with the wing curved to the left, mm -hmm. right? So that it goes so that it goes up here and it flies with the wing to the left a little bit. Okay. We want to be able to throw it with the wing to the right. Mm -hmm. Also with the wing down. Okay. Yeah. And with the wing up. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to curve it to the left. So let's set the angle, reach up, set it on that shelf. Good. There you go. And let's curve it to the right. Yep, reach up, set it on that shelf. Good. And hold the wing down. Reach up and set it on that shelf. That one's going to be a great job, Sue. So, and wing up. Good. Good, good. Um, we go through that again. What's that? We go through that again. Okay, we have the wing to the left. We're going to curl it up and set it on that shelf. Good. We really want to reach up there, though. The farther we reach up, the reach up. The farther we reach up, the less throw we have to make. Good. And then curve it with the wing to the right. Different just go back to the, uh, okay. just check it without the throw. Oh. Let's check it. Good. And that might be a little extreme. How about right there? It's a little extreme. How about right there? Let's rewind it and put it to right there. Great job. And let's set it on that shelf and release it. All right. And then with the wing down, put it done. That's awesome. And with the wing up. And this is going to be the natural way. It's going to be pretty much the easiest way for you to go. And if you're watching Sue here, um, she's got a real short stroke. And I would consider that an advanced application to, to take a short stroke and pop it high. Mm -hmm. What we really want to do is reach a real long stroke and get that moving before we let go. And what that's going to do is set that nice, smooth. Mm -hmm. Release right there. Again, we're just taking it up and setting it on the shelf. Yep. A little more. Let's just set okay, it. so now we've got um, the concept reaching low, setting it on the shelf, right? Mm -hmm. What we're going to do is we're going to throw it as high as we can, as high as we can. We're going to reach up, set it on that shelf as high as we can. It should come back straight down -ish. So reach way down, throw it up as high as you can. Yep, really crank it up there. Beautiful. Dude, that's awesome. <laughs> Again, throw it way in the heck up there. Way up there. Oh. Good. Remember to keep setting it on the shelf. Set it on the shelf. Check it. Beautiful. Let's do one more. Good. Now toss one, two, three feet up there. Beautiful. Super easy, right? Go into that huge expression, the huge expression of that vault, okay? Uh, makes this nice, easy two foot toss super easy. I want you to throw it behind you, make it land on your back. Throw it behind you. Yep, throw it right behind you. Good. Actually, throw it behind you. Throw it right back there. Good. Good. Nice. It's not 
not important that it lands on your back. What is important when uh, when we're throwing it and it shoots out from the front, uh -huh. all we want to do is make sure that it goes backwards. Okay. okay. And a lot of times, just throwing backwards is going to set it up over top of you. That's right. Um, if you notice that it shoots off the corner, uh -huh. if I hold until the end and flick, do you see where it goes? Uh -huh. shoot out that way? Yeah. That's what happens when, when you're trying to throw a vault toss and it shoots out to the right. Mm -hmm. It's because you're flicking at the end. That's why okay. we're focused on getting that rotation developed through. All right. Right? Uh -huh. And once we're here, then the rotation goes up as opposed to ping. Yeah. Gonna go over me. Okay, okay. we're gonna throw at the same time. Oh, you're gonna go higher than me. Ready? Yeah. Ready? One, two, three. And you'll go higher than me. And again. Good. And I'll go higher than you. Try not to throw it so far. Oh, okay. That vault toss. Don't throw it out there. Throw it. Oh, okay. sorry. Okay. I'll go higher than you. And this is going to set up kind of that rush that you get with your dog. Okay. Like when you're trying to do this with your dog and you go to throw, she's going to be like all over you and pressuring yeah. you. Yeah. And what we can do is we can just play this game as a pair. Uh -huh. Ready? And we can work on our vault toss and be rushed. And have some practice being rushed and still delivering a good target. Good, curve it left. Good, curve it right. Nice. You got right here.